it's uh, Saturday, Mario. Yeah. What do you think about the weather? For me, it's not good. For me, it's good. Because it's raining, but hopefully it's raining also in three hours when we have the qualifying. It's been raining a lot this night and everything is dirty inside of here. No, 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 Don't no, stress no, so much, no, eh? No, no, no. It's not good for your heart, buddy. No, no, no. <laughs> we are now preparing for the quali. It's in 50 minutes and the weather has stopped to rain. It's actually starting to dry a little bit, so I think it's going to be half wet, half dry. So it's going to be a hard one. Theodor is actually out on the track now having qualifying. That was not him, but he's out there. Qualification is now done. The car is in park from here. We managed to go to Q2, but from there on I'm only managed uh, P12. So I start P12 on both races now. And now we only have, have like one hour to get the car ready to, to first race. And the car is still in park from here, so we cannot do anything. So we're gonna have stress now to get ready for the first race. It looks like it's gonna be half dry again. The qualifying wasn't half dry, it was a rate tires, but it was half dry. I think we also need to clean the car a little bit. And this park from here, this is after every quality and race races. Because of investigation or if somebody's protesting or something, they keep the car there so you cannot hide evidence or this kind of stuff, you know? So every time the car is staying inside this grid after quality and races for like half an hour till maximum an hour. I really hope you had a better qualifying than me, eh? Yeah, P3. P3? Yeah, yeah congrats, <laughs> good. <laughs> Park for me is open and we just quickly quick clean it before we bring it to the tent. So, pre grid for race one, start in a few minutes. We'll make it. Wish me luck, I'm nervous, like always. More time! We are now in the uh, heading. Technique, technique control after the race. Why are we that? Because did a good job today. I get a, did a good, good job. Not in the quality, finished P12, started well, and finished P2. Is that good enough? That's good. And we are really happy because it's the first podium in a TCR series. Okay. That's to be happy with, eh? We are not done, done with technique control. And it's good. Everything is good. Now the car is going down to park for me again. So Taylor, are you happy with my race? Yeah, really happy. Was it good, one, eh? Yeah, great. <laughs> great race. Thank you. So Airboy, are you happy with my race? Could have been better. <laughs> <laughs> Idiot. You didn't mean that, eh? It could have been better, I agree, yeah, but... Yeah, sure, one from, place. But from P12 is good to go to it's P2. <laughs> Paul, are you happy with my race? Yes, I am happy. Good job. Very happy? Super happy. You should be. Like buy you, buy you extra, extra. Uh, what, what do you want? To, what do, I, I don't know what to give you. I want to have a big slice of meat. Big slice of meat. Yeah, I, I buy you tonight. Big okay. slice of meat with barnesos, eh? Yeah. Please. And finally, Mario. What? Are you happy with my race? For sure. Was it good? Are you happy? <laughs> <laughs> so it seems like everybody is happy. Now we're gonna clean, prepare for tomorrow. The car is still in park for me over there. Uh, there it is. And then later we're gonna go and celebrate with uh, like, a little beef, like my like uh, Falk said, with good sauce. On. Here is a trophy, second place, Hungar ring, really nice trophy actually. My first one in the TCR race, so I think we should be happy about it. It's the first one, but for sure not the last one. The boys are a little bit laughing at me because they think I'm going crazy now with two cappuccinos with vanilla and sugar. This is what my celebration now. Don't laugh at me. I have been so high on myself now, so I forgot that Theodor also finished three today. <laughs> Congratulations to him. Hey, go you. and follow him. Hey, I put you. a link below. He's a really nice guy, actually. Next time you have to save a little bit more from this. <laughs> <laughs> I will, Mario. I will save a little bit more of your pain. I actually, I actually tried to save. I was just doing, doing a little shower with it, and then stop it. Not so much. Yeah, next time, sorry. <laughs> I just want to say thanks a lot to my family, mom and dad, my brother, all my guys here, all my sponsors. Without all of you guys and many more, this would not be possible. We would not get these trophies without you guys. And I'm really happy we managed a good result. Um, yeah, I'm happy for myself first of all, and I'm really happy for the guys around me, my sponsors, my family. Everyone is happy now, and um, I really appreciate it. We're gonna get more of those. It's uh, cleaning time. It's not too much damage, but little bit we have here, but that's no problem. I fix it when I come back to Germany. So I thought, how is the bet going now? 
I think uh, you lost. I, lost I have now 18. So you will get 18. <laughs> no, I get more tomorrow. <laughs> I hope. Now we're going to speak with the Danish, my Danish friend. Hello, Jens. How are you doing? Fine. Congratulations. You. You, did Congratulations. A... you too. We both did a really good race today. Yeah, but I have a big damage in the front. Yeah, but it was good, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, shouldn't it? It's good. Can you say that again, but maybe with, not with those words, eh? Ah, very well done. <laughs> yeah, that's... <laughs> <laughs> How well, are you? Awesome job. Yeah, very thank good. You, thank you, thank you. good to watch. Thank you. It was exciting, weren't yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> No, well done. They say it's going to be storm tonight. So we are preparing with some extra lines in the tent. So it's not down there on the track tomorrow morning. That will be shit. <laughs> Don't be gentle, it's a rental, eh? <laughs> we are leaving the track now. Ciao, guys. Now we're going to go and buy a beef with Barney or Polk. Beef, yeah, it's good. <laughs> it's gonna be good. We said now it's actually fantastic because it's 1917. It's the first time in week so long we can remember we are going back to the hotel when it's still light outside. Normally it's completely dark, so that's good. It's only the the old and strong guys who is having bruschetta at the start, right? So the kids don't want to have it. Someone have a handbrake problem. <laughs> So this is a clutch problem. He's dri driving with the handbrake on. Look at the rear tire. It's a girl. The tire is stuck. Falk is not helping. Falk, are you a mechanic or what? It's, it's down. It's <laughs> Sunday, eh? I'm eating breakfast, Falk is making coffee. For everyone. Falk is the coffee meister. Barista. Barista. Okay. It's around 45 minutes left, till we have to be ready and go to the grid. So we have a little time now because car is ready, so now we start to pack down and prepare the, the trip home. Yeah. Race 2 is just done. Ben, I this ended. Is for personal use only. You yeah, have personal use only. <laughs> I ended P10, it was a bad race, but I'll tell you about it later. My friend here asked, to borrow my, or asked to borrow my pool. Oh, yeah, it's really nice. And I said yes, but what I didn't tell you is that I took my last bath before the race now and I made pee pee in it. <laughs> I don't care. No, I see that. <laughs> but don't drink it, eh? Yeah, yeah good really race. Fun. Where did you finish? Seven? Yeah. Seven. Yeah. Very good. From 13 and you 12 to 10, eh? Yeah. Uh, seven is good. I finished 10 from 12. It was. Um, I don't know, but this setup was good on Friday on the first pre-practice, but now it was not working at all. But this was also not a good track for the Cupra, right? for the Seats, Cupras, not Seat anymore. So I think I was the best Cupra this weekend. Mikkel was just in front of me after the start and he was just a little bit faster than me and he was the leader of the championship. So the speed compared to the other Cupras and Mikkel was pretty good, but we don't have chance on other brands here. But this is how it is, we're going to be stronger next time, I think. And the reason why I said it's going to go better next time is because it's we have something called BOP, balance of performance. So this weekend was the Hyundai's and the Honda's really, really good. So they get more kilos in the car for the next race. And when the Cupra was really bad, we're going to keep our weight. So next time, guys, we hope for a better one. <laughs> Sorry, mate. <laughs> we are now done eating and now we are packing full throttle. You look sexy, eh? <laughs> Can please the guy or girl who was here leaving this stuff tell me who she was or he was? Thanks a lot, I appreciate it. But I have no idea where, who would throw this stuff into my tent. We are soon done and that's so nice. Gippy, I just want to say thanks a lot for the weekend. Thank you. Always nice to see you. You too. Sometimes I ask myself and sometimes I wonder if we are really brothers. How is it going, boys? Is this you need more people than this <laughs> I need more people to pack down my pool than we need for the tent. All right, we are closing up. Careful, boys. Perfect. So, boys, we are ready. So, yes. give us the money. <laughs> <laughs> the money? You don't get paid. Ciao, boys. Have a nice trip, eh? With the fucking plane you guys is taking. I'm going with this one. Hola Playboy! Ciao!
Thank you for the See weekend. You. See you, eh? See you. Ciao. Bye. Ciao, ciao. So, we are done packed. I'm on my way back. I go to Germany now. I am not sure what I actually told you in the movies earlier on how it was going today, but we ended P10, started 12. I got few positions free again, some crashed and some get penalties in front of me. So it was actually not good at all for me, but we got this one point and this is what, this is what we managed to do today with what we had and what I could do. So sometimes we just have to accept that this is how it is and we have to try to do a better result next time. But we learned a lot today and that's important. It's important to learn new stuff every, every time so you can get better and better. That's actually the most important stuff. So we keep pushing, I drive back to Germany now and from there we just keep, keep pushing full throttle. I'm in traffic here and the guys in front is having a pretty big argument. They're almost driving into each other and two times the guy stopped them and went out to the car. Look at this guy, eh? Now it's coming out again. Third time it's going over to the guy. I have now been driving for around a little bit more than four hours. I'm just outside Wien and now I stop for diesel. Because diesel you really need to have. I'm also gonna fill up myself with some food, I think. But hey, I have to tell you guys something. I am not going straight up to Konrad now, home to Germany. I am now going to München, to Munich, because I have a huge fan who really wanted to see me, and it's actually only an hour and a half extra to drive. So I will drive past and say hello. I am trying to not eat too much bread, but I had bread and something to have on top of it left now from the boys this weekend, so I eat this now instead of buying something else. It's also really easy and it goes fast, so I can continue drive. Then we push further on. Oh, we are going this way, Linz. I now start to buy myself a cup of coffee or something with a lot of sugar inside. I can now feel it has been a long, long weekend. But I have to say, it's much more nice to leave a race weekend with like the result we had yesterday than leave it with a crashed car we did two times earlier <laughs> this year. This is a much better feeling. I am now a little bit under one hour away from, from Munich. It's uh, one o'clock in the morning or in the night. I stopped here now because now I'm gonna sleep a few hours. I just come to think of, I have to send the email to my sponsor and tell them how it went this weekend. I am now washed up with some bottles with water and it's time to continue on. Oh, now I'm really tired. So then I continue to München. It's only one hour to the, to the place I'm gonna meet my, meet my fan. München's morning traffic. It's actually not too bad. So I'm here in Munich, München. I'm gonna wait for my fan. Then. I'm a little bit too early, but I'm gonna do some office work now. So that's no stress. So I just have been, I just had lunch with my fan. We are entering the car now. And now we're gonna drive back. Hello! I think you guys know who this is, eh? <laughs> they can write in the comment field if they don't, so don't yeah, mention the name. If you, if you, guess who this is? This is the question of today. Guess who this is? <laughs> they can also guess which car uh, we are driving. But um, like I told him Miller here, I'm, I'm not such a nice passenger. I don't like to be the passenger, but I always worry. Look. Do you have a microphone on your phone? Only the orange phone. <laughs> <laughs> Hello. It's not every day a two-time DTM champion is making me coffee, eh? No, he's called a fan today. Yeah, you are the fan, yeah, that's correct. <laughs> I am on the road again, and from here to Konrad is it 600 km exactly. So that's not too bad. Ah, you stopped for some diesel. Now I'm gonna take a little bit to eat at the same time. I think I'm gonna eat the muesli now. Today I actually feel it has been a long weekend and uh, not too much sleep this night. I am feeling quite pretty, pretty tired today actually. And I have to say one thing. It was really, really cool to meet Matthias today and 
I learned a lot of stuff and it was cool to hear his story because he had been a really really hard working guy himself he still is but he he have he managed a lot he achieved a lot but he have been working for it and it's cool to see it give, uh, gives much much more motivation for me so that's really cool or Something is for sure wrong because it's going so slow and did for a long time. I just, I just wake up after sleeping uh, two hours, I think. I know, but I had to stop and sleep. I was so tired. I didn't manage to do to go further on today. Or I will go further on now, but it was so much traffic over today, and the sun was so warm that I was just so tired. I just had to stop and sleep a little bit. But now we continue. <sighs> It's only 266 kilometers left to the workshop. So I'm gonna be there like 10 o'clock tonight. It's not too bad. It's 10 past 10 in the evening, Monday, and I'm back here at the workshop. Now I'm actually gonna load out. Hello, youngs! <laughs> Hello! Where have you guys been? Uh, we went to buy some blue paper. I heard <laughs> blue paper? <laughs> That's not nice at all. Ramps are ready. Let's fire her up. Looks cool in the dark, eh? Trailer is cleaned. I hope Franz and the guys didn't park anything at my parking spot here because then I'm gonna eat it because I see absolutely garnix. Back over here now. So with this, we say cheerio. And um, again, thank for watching. Please subscribe. Please post a comment and tell me what you think. And um, I'll just load up a few things here now and then I'll go to bed. So see you later on.